So somebody wants to know if getting a master's degree will help with their future building their CV. And he specifically mentions freelancing. So let me just start off by reading and then I'll answer the questions. Hello, Stefan. In the current context, what do you think which type of master's degree would make more sense to future-proof one CV slash career? A master's in AI or one in some classical computer science field, i.e. E, uh, e.g. software engineer, distributed systems. Currently, I work as a front-end developer at a big corporation with a focus on React, but I'm considering going freelance in the future, offering web development services. The current evolution of AI makes me wonder if I should perhaps start focusing in that direction. So, freelance is typically about the web. That's number one. Uh, number two, when you're doing freelance, especially in the beginning, you're going to be dealing pretty much with small business. So the AI need in terms of providing them AI services or AI integration within their own uh, business is highly unlikely at this point. That said, you should be aware of the AI solutions that are out there so that you can uh, leverage them to provide a, a better outcome for them. So you're developing their websites. You may use AI just to help you write the code more quickly and efficiently, just as a simple example. Or maybe you're going to use AI to generate placeholder, placeholder images, etc. So AI, whether or not you become an AI implementer, an AI provider, uh, or you just use AI to speed up your own workflows, you should become aware of AI if you're in the tech space Actually, you should become aware of AI no matter what space you're in. See if there's any advantage it can provide for you. So he's asking me about getting a master's degree. Well, the master's degree is going to have zero impact in terms of freelancing. So if you're saying, I want to get a master's degree because I want to get it to freelance, I say it's a total waste of time. The master's degree will not land you any more contracts. On the other hand, if you want to work for big corporations... Uh, a master's degree in AI could be useful to you because AI is hot now. It could remain hot and continues to, and start to dominate over the next 10 years. It seems likely it's going to get hotter and hotter over time. I'm just not sure how much of a real impact AI is going to have over the next 5, 10 years. It's hard to say. Remember when Meta went all out with their uh, VR a headset, oh, it's going to change the world, it's going to work in the virtual world, and, you know, it's dropping back down to hyper-niche, you know, AR, VR situation. Uh, same thing when uh, crypto first came out. Remember, NFTs and crypto is going to change the world and bagging. Not really. It's, 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 it hasn't done anything, right? So keep that in mind. So uh, that being said, having a master's in AI I'm sure it could have some positive impact in terms of getting a job. But if your job goal is really freelancing, then don't waste your time there. Just jump into the game, start freelancing, start building products for people. As usual, if you want to go from career A to B, transition to it. Follow my freelance videos on how to transition from your full-time position to the freelance position, and you'll feel out the market. You're probably going to see... The, the demand in the uh, small business world is going to be older technologies that you might find very boring. I'm not trying to say don't do it. I'm just, you know, you're going to see a lot of WordPress, a lot of e-commerce work, some Drupal work maybe. So it's not going to be super exciting stuff unless you really focus on that. You focus on getting into the AI space and providing AI services for companies. That's a whole different issue uh, altogether. Anyway, I hope that helps. I'm Uncle Stan. Thank you.